Scott, what's Good. up, man? How are you? How are you? Nice to see you again. Scott and I yeah. hung out a lot. Scott, is that your bed in the background? <laughs> Maybe. Yes, it is. <laughs> okay, it's great. Fantastic. <laughs> and I've got a bit of blue justice going on. I love it. It's perfect. Light in. Light in. All good. Guys, congratulations on the film. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. It is. Uh, it's so much fun. It is so much fun. Uh, I had an absolute, absolute blast. Uh, sequels are very, very tough at the best of times. Did you guys feel, though, with this, that when you got the scripts that they were kind of onto something and this would be as good, if not better, than, than the first one? Yeah, well, you just never know. I never know where they're going to go with it. You always feel like, okay, what do we, what do, we do now, mm -hmm. right? We kind of feel like we blew it out a little bit on the first film, and then, you know, you get the, you get the feeling that the studio's going to let us have more fun this next time around, but where is he going to go? And I get the impression, of course, that Robotnik wasn't gone for good, so he's going to be back in some shape or form, and, you know, how, but when you read the script, you're like, ah, this is, <laughs> this is how you do it. This is how you, uh, you expand the universe and, and just kind of blow up the scale of the whole thing and, and turbocharge it all. Uh, but then, it, like you, just like seeing the movie for the first time, it's one thing reading the script, it's another thing when the animation's all put together and the scenes are all cut together, it's completely different, and it's bigger and more vast and uh, more entertaining than I anticipated, so I'm very proud of it. Yeah, you can't keep Jim Carrey down. Come on now, he needs to. No, no, come on. You no, get no. Jim Carrey for a movie, you keep Jim Carrey in the movie, as many <laughs> movies as you can do. And then you introduce <laughs> even more CG characters and more amazing people voicing them. Yeah. Uh, ben, for you, I know you're a big fan, fan of the video games. To have Tails and Knuckles and all these amazing kind of odes to the to the second game, because the second game was actually the first game that I played when I was a kid. I, I think the far yeah. superior game out of the first two. Oh, so that's literally what I was about to say, the far superior game. I'm glad you agree. Uh, but there's so many nuggets from the from the games in there, and it felt like playing the game as a movie. Uh, what was it like for you as a fan to see it all put together that, that they'd managed to kind of get it the second game into awesome. the film? awesome. Because we introduced, at the end of the first one, we introduced Tails and the idea that, okay, Tails is opening up, that means someone from their world is coming in here. And the idea of Knuckles, that means two people from Sonic's world is coming in here. So as someone who's a fan of the games, there are so many Easter eggs in this movie. I mean, talking about locations where we shoot, but also exact poses that these characters do. Like, And also there's, there's aspects of us being underwater. And if you've ever played a Sonic game, you know how mm -hmm. terrifying it is to be underwater as Sonic anytime in any of the games. So... It's like, uh, it's a dream come true. I get to also, as a, as a nerdy kid, I get to do scenes with Tails, Colleen, and Idris as Knuckles. So it's like, it's, it's great. I think that's what they handled so well. After we got Greenland for the second one, they just blew it out, made it bigger, and we're like, you know what, we're gonna take care of the fans even more, and if you don't know the video games, we're gonna introduce you to what this world could be that some of these gamers already know about. And so they did an amazing job. It's very exciting. Yeah, I love the air bubbles. I mean, Not come on, you got, if we're underwater, you got to have some air bubbles. <laughs> uh, just finally, before I go, you're obviously doing the third one, which is, which is fantastic already, and obviously you're going to get the spin-off. I wonder if you noticed the fact that there's a lot of subtle hints to someone and their films in this film that I don't know if subliminally you're trying to get that person to be in the third film. Uh, there's a little bit of risky business. There's a little bit of Tom oh. Gunny. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, if you if you need someone, surely. wait. What's the what's the other one? What's the other Tom Cruise reference? Uh, so there was a risky business one. Yep. There's a Top Gun one. Is I think in there somewhere. Oh, I guess I guess playing volleyball, the the high five maybe. Yeah. yeah okay. Yeah yeah, yeah. 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 Did you know that? Uh, there's See, a few others. The, I don't. The, there's like two yeah. separate movies being filmed. Right, the live action and then his stuff. But did you know that when you were doing it? Or just I now that you're bringing it up, I would have been like, okay, when they high five. It's a very, it's you're in that scene. It's when uh, Shamari at like. Uh, uh, oh right, right. And right. then afterwards they go like that. <laughs> That's right. You have like your that. shirt on, James. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's right. Yes, I kept the shirt. But on. hey, I'm just putting it out there. Third movie, Jim Carrey and Tom Cruise. I think. Hey. Great. Really interesting. Uh, yeah. Great. Sure, that would be, yeah, of yeah, course. Yeah. Can you what do you want to happen? <laughs> One of the top 10 movie stars of all time? Sure, that would be fantastic. Well, also, he works pretty much exclusively for Paramount, so. That's true. It seems like you're setting this up. Do you, are you Tom Cruise's agent? I mean, he doesn't, he doesn't need an agent. He's just Tom Cruise. Uh, gentlemen, lovely to talk to you. Good to talk, talk to you, man. Uh, you too. The movie was fantastic. Good luck. Thanks, Thanks brother. You. Appreciate it. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys. Is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey, you guys.